In general, information entered into a computer can vary drastically. It may be light, sound, heat, etc. The properties of these physical phenomena change smoothly in time. Therefore, before you enter the information into the computer, with its discrete brains, it should be conveyed into other forms, and namely electric signals or the received frequencies using a transducer. Analog signals of alternating voltage correspond to the changes in the real characteristics of the measured values. An analog signal is, however, only the first step, as digital devices use binary logic. It means that their circuits operate according to the principle on or off. The signal can consequently undergo some more changes, or in other words, should be translated into binary representation language. This translation is achieved by a so-called analog to digital converter. An ADC converts an analog signal voltage into a 0-1 pulse sequence. These pulses correspond to a binary code which can represent any digit in the form ones and zeros. Ones and zeros in digital devices are represented by two states of circuits on which a central processing unit, internal memory and other computing units are based. In order to transform an analog signal into a digital code, an ADC measures the amplitude of an analog signal at strictly defined intervals. The intervals are defined in such a way that some the rate could be twice as high as high frequency component of the measuring signal. As an ADC takes measurements, a central digit is assigned to each interval. The measured value is directly proportional to the digit.